dun 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 nom 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 so we're going to use a baiting needle just makes it a bit easier to bait up I've got a ragworm here and I'm going to grip it just behind the head make sure it doesn't bite me take the point end of the baiting needle and put it through the mouth and thread the worm up the baiting needle just kind of push it down as far as you can keep going as far down as we can go now this is a size one hook and we just put it in the little indent at the end of the baiting needle hold the line tight and I'm going to push the worm up the hook I'm going to push it over the eye there and uh, pull it up the line a bit now once we've done this we're going to pinch off the very end of the worm this is important because if we leave that on and a fish grabs it it can pull the whole worm down the hook and so there we have it a single ragworm bait now if we want to make it a bit bigger what we're going to do is we're going to add a couple more worms to the uh, to the bait here it just gives it a bit more movement and what we're going to do again is just take the ragworm and just hook it on through the head and we can add more worms in exactly the same way you can just grip them behind the head just hook them just behind the head there or through the mouth and that's going to create a bigger bait for a bigger fish and and a bit more create a bit more movement in the water and there we have it one larger ragworm bait dun 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 nom nom nom